Okay, so we are on a really limited time frame here because he does not like to get his diaper changed. But I wanted to show you the best diapers for tiny, tiny little babies. So Cruz was born at 5 pounds, 10 ounces. However, he got down to 5 pounds, 1 ounce. And I just wanted to show you the diapers that fit the best on him when he was extremely tiny. So this diaper he's wearing actually did not fit um, under his umbilical cord. This is a great diaper, but it didn't fit. So... Okay, number one is a Noble BB pre-flat in the newborn size, and it fits really well underneath the umbilical cord, even on tiny babies, because you can fold this down as low as you need and fold the wings around. And so this one actually fits on very tiny babies. The, the thing that you end up running into a problem, you are going to actually need a diaper pin because a snappy is just so huge on such a little guy and i'm afraid it's poking through that one layer okay diaper number two are the lil joeys by rumperoos and these are known for fitting very small babies including preemies and they do fit under the umbilical cord um even on crews because you can snap down here to these lower snaps, even down here if you need, which is really nice. So that gives you some flexibility and you can really get this diaper down low so that it will fit under the umbilical cord on tiny, tiny little babies. So the Rumperoos by Lil Joey definitely fits little babies. Now the Bummies Super Bright Newborn Cover is tiny. It's a great cover. And so that one fits really, really well. Actually, it has this little dip here. And this is actually one of my uh, newborn or preemie inserts that I make. So that is one of mine, and it fits in here perfect. And we're going to show this diaper real fast. The other thing is you can just kind of um, Velcro these down low so that it will go under the umbilical cord. And, you know, might need to overlap them a little bit to get them tighter on the legs. But does fit underneath the umbilical cord even if you pull it up a little bit see that second gusset in there is actually catching his legs so he is actually yeah it's actually fitting around his legs so tiny tiny little cover Now, the smallest diaper cover that I have ever seen is the Sigzazor, which is from Amazon, and it even has crossover snaps, and it fits so tiny. It has rise snaps, so you can adjust it a little bit, but it gets the smallest of any diaper that I have seen. And again, there's one of my inserts in here. This is a contoured one. This one definitely fits underneath the umbilical cord. This one, I actually didn't, I don't even need to make the waist, you know, like as small as it will go. And look at how, how good the legs fit. So this cover just gets tiny. It would fit a smaller baby than Cruz. This diaper, I would say, would even fit a four pound baby. And so, yeah, definitely a very tiny cover. Now, this one, I'm not sure if it actually will fit or not, because when I took it to the hospital, this snap ripped off. I'll add a picture. Thankfully, I make 
uh, cloth pads myself, so I actually had this exact same color snap in my inventory, so I replaced the snap. You can kind of see where it ripped off, but I didn't get a chance to use it, but it does look tiny, so we're going to try it right now. This is just a tester, um, a trial. So we're just going to see. But I have a feeling it's going to fit a tiny baby. Yep, I wish this one had not broken at the hospital because that's actually a great fit. Look at that. Oh, the leg's a little big. The legs are a little bit big. But the rest of it fits really well. Yeah, the legs are a little big. Might be able to make it tighter. I just, I don't like making the waist really tight. I don't like making them uncomfortable. It always just seems like it would be so uncomfortable. That's better, but it looks a little tight to me, so I wouldn't want it quite that tight. But yeah, that one would fit a, a small baby, but just a little bit bigger legs. He has such tiny legs. Next is the Eco Posh Fitted, and this one is actually a pretty big, bulky, like a bulky diaper, but it actually fit him, you know, at a very, very tiny size. And the inside is so soft. All right, this is actually the first time he's had a passy, and it's for this video, so, so I could do this video. Oh, you've got a hold of your passy, honey. So as you can see, though, it fits under his umbilical cord great. And the legs are a little bit big, but it does, I mean, it fit him really well at the hospital. It fit him really well. So I am a big fan of this one. Okay, then the Happy Behinds Tiny Newborn All-in-One. This is basically just exactly like the little Joey's. It's just a little bit uh, less expensive and uh, made in China. So it is a China cheapie. But again, it fits really, really tiny babies. So when they call it the tiny newborn all-in-one, it really truly is. Because look at that. That fits a tiny, tiny little baby. Look at that. And it fits around his legs really well. So the Happy Behinds Tiny Newborn All-in-One. Then one of my new all-time favorites is the Green Mountain Diapers Cloth Ease Size Zero Cloth Diaper Cover. Super, super cool. It has all these snaps on it. it. does have the umbilical cord snap down. And it has two settings for that. So if your baby's a bigger baby, you can use this one. And if your baby's a smaller baby, you can use this one. And it then has, of course, the snaps. It has the higher up snaps for a bigger baby. And then it has the much lower snaps down here for a smaller baby. So really super flexible cover. And it's so soft. It's actually made of TPU instead of PUL. It's very soft. One of the nicest covers I've ever used. I love it. And this is a really cool insert. I wanted to include this. It's a newborn insert from Blessed Berry Bums. And these are available on Facebook, and they're very cool. Her design is really innovative, and uh, this is perfect. It fits in all of his newborn diapers. I really, really like this. So I have that inside this, but uh, this one works really well with flats or, you know, whatever else. Whatever you want to use, uh, this, co this cover works great over it. And... See how it goes way, way, way down and then snap it way down here and Cruz wore this one, you know, right away after he was born and look at that. I mean, it's way down there and the fit is fabulous 
and there is double gus double leg gussets here and it is catching his leg on the inside so catches his tiny tiny little legs and it's just so soft it looks like it would just be so comfortable so i love this one Then the Happy Flute Newborn, and it again has one of my inserts in it. It's a Snap-in Bamboo Velour insert, and this one again kind of goes down here. And it fits on a tiny, tiny little baby. Not quite as well as some of the others, but it still does fit, so it was worth mentioning. And again, it's the Happy Flute Newborn Cloth Diaper Cover. And then we have the Green Mountain Diapers Cloth Ease Organic Muslin Diaper. And it is... Just basically a smaller flat and I would just fold it in half and then do my flat fold from here and then there's also the size half flat from Green Mountain Diapers and this is the organic bird's eye cotton and again I would just fold these in half and do the flat fold from there so let's see if you guys can see this <laughs> here okay I'm gonna fold this up this down then I'm gonna fold this over and this over so it looks like this and that's gonna go under his bottom okay then we're going to roll the legs Okay, and we're going to pull the front up and the wings around and secure with a snappy and look at that amazing fit on a newborn and that is the bird's eye cotton the organic bird's eye cotton size half flat and then we're going to do the same thing with this one, which hopefully you can see. He is kind of asleep, so I'm actually going to pull it down a little bit to make it more of a square. And with this one, I'll do a little bit different of a fold. So I will do, let's see, I'm just going to pull both these sides in in the front like that. So we're going to go with this shape and pull it down in the back that first fold i showed you is called the neat fold it's one of my very favorites this one i'm not sure what the name is i honestly don't even know all right we're going to roll these legs in and we're going to pull this up and as i pull it up make sure it stays snug around his legs I'm also going to fold it down and you can fold it as low as you need and then pull the wings around and again snappy and there we have that fold whatever it's called on a newborn. I'll show you the neat fold one more time. You fold in the bottom, the top, fold one side over so it's flush with the top, the other side over so it's flush with the top. Okay, and again, this is the muslin diaper, and we're gonna roll, we're gonna roll, and then we're going to fold this up. And you can fold that down, fold that down, and we're going to, whoops, snappy it, all right, and 
we're going to cover this up with cloth ease wrap since he doesn't have his umbilical cord anymore i'm just going to leave this i'm just going to leave it un unsnapped and there it is so there he is all right so those are the best cloth diapers for tiny little babies for newborn preemie babies if you are considering cloth diapering or if you have a preemie or if you have you know normally you have really tiny babies then this video should be helpful for you it shouldn't matter you know whether you have a girl or a boy they should fit the same just they're good diapers for tiny little babies. And I just thought that this video was important to make because I don't think that there's a lot of videos out there about cloth diapering a tiny little baby, which he is definitely the tiniest baby that I have cloth diapered and the tiniest baby that I've seen cloth diapers on. I'm sure there's been smaller, but he's, you know, one of the littler ones that I've seen. And um, he got down like I said, to five pounds. He got down to five pounds at one point. So he was almost in the four pound range. And a lot of these cloth diapers worked excellent for him. They worked absolutely just perfect. So I just really wanted to share this video. I hope that you guys find it helpful. Uh, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you are new here. I have a lot of reviews coming up that I'm working really hard on and I do have more newborn cloth diaper videos coming and um, I'm just in the process of editing. So I definitely would love if you would subscribe. I'd love to have you. And it looks like my comment section may be back on after almost a year of it not being on. So you may be able to just comment on the video, but if not, if for some reason the comments are not on, then you can comment on the community tab above or on Facebook or Instagram. All my social media links, affiliate links, coupon codes, uh, ways to support the channel, just all sorts of stuff like that is in the description box down below. So if you have not checked that out, I would definitely re recommend that. And I look forward to seeing you guys soon for the next video. A huge thank you to my partner here. He did excellent for the video. So thank you so much, buddy. You did so good. He crashed out. And mama is tired. I am about to crash out too. So I will see you guys very soon for the next video. Until next time, good night, goodbye, and stay blessed.